printed in the Bible, now yeah. seen with maps. This piece of land was completely removed and never spoken about again. Could someone actually be hiding the Garden of Eden from us? Subscribe if you love Jesus and type Jesus is King in the comments. Is the Garden of Eden actually in the North Pole? In the book of Genesis, chapter 2, verse 10, it says a river watering the garden flowed from Eden. From there, it was separated into four headwaters, and those four headwaters are Bishon, Gihon, Tigris, and Euphrates. Fast forward to today, we only know the location of two of these rivers, and logically speaking, the Garden of Eden should exist around that area, right? But what if, when the flood of Noah happened, everything changed? What if the landmarks were shifted, and what we identified are actually in completely different areas? Well, the 15th and 16th century Mercator maps of the North Pole showed a land with four specific headwaters emerging from it, bearing geographic similarity to what was recorded in the Bible. However, in subsequent maps, this piece of land was completely removed and never spoken about again. Could someone actually be hiding the Garden of Eden from us? Subscribe if you love Jesus and type Jesus is King in the comment. Is the Garden of Eden actually in the North Pole? In the book of Genesis, chapter 2, verse 10, it says a river watering the garden flowed from Eden. From there, it was separated into four red waters, and those four red waters are Bishon, Gion, Tigris, and Euphrates. Fast forward to today, we only know the location of two of these rivers, and logically speaking, the garden. Everything. What if the land were 
Thank <laughs> you. 